he's behind her. Where is he? Right behind her. Oh. oh my god, look. I've never seen her lying down here. Oh, she's guarding him. <laughs> he's like literally flat out. Finn, you are so cute. Oh, she's getting up. The spider's like, oh, bloody okay. hell. Watch this. I'll bring him as well because it looks like Bridget. She literally knows it's us. Look, she's coming over. She's like, that's my people. How pretty it is, Finn. Considering Finn was like terrified of some cows the other day, she's now in a field with them. She's doing so well. You're such a clever girl. Look at the little babies. Oh, God. Definitely don't want to keep my hand off the reins for too long. <laughs> Finners was a very, very brave girl today. Um, she went into a field of cows, just the cows that we have here on the farm. So they're really chilled, like they don't mind horses going in. Um, but she was really good. I, I didn't really want to let go of the reins for very long. So like I did a tiny bit of videoing. Oh, having a canter. But yeah, she was a good girl. She was super spooky on the way back though. Like really spooky. She needed to grow up. <laughs> but anyway, the cow situation was very good, Finley. Good morning, internet. Um, so it is Monday today and it's a very sunny Monday. So I'm gonna go out and I'm gonna enjoy the sun with Finners. I'm gonna go out for a hack today. Um, I don't actually know how long I can ride for. I need to consult my fitness plan. Uh, I haven't looked at it for like a week, so I don't really know what's going on with it. Hopefully I'll get a little bit of footage when I'm riding, but at the moment Finn's a little bit spooky and it just depends whether I can actually video. Um, or whether I feel okay to video. <laughs> so I've just had a look at my fitness plan and I can hack for 50 minutes uh, with like a more trot than normal. So that's pretty cool. Um, so I'll easily get around a block, which is really, really nice because I went round um, like the smallest block that we have um, just to test. I didn't know if I'd make it round um, in 45 minutes with not very much trot and I did so I'll be able to do this in 50 minutes easily um, so yeah I think I might be able to try a different block today how awesome is that why can't I lock my own bloody door oh it's because there's keys in there <gasps> guys um, so luckily I feel fine to take a hand off of the reins now <laughs> Finners is although she's still spooky she's like more chilled spooky so uh, I feel like I can video and ride <laughs> we're just doing a different loop today um, because we can ride for a little bit longer I've done the shortest one and that was fine and then yeah this is kind of the next level up it's, it's a tiny little bit longer, but I love this hack. It's such a nice one. There's loads of trees and yeah, I mean, we're really lucky around here that there's amazing hacking. It's just mostly single track lanes where hardly anyone drives up. So yes, it's awesome and it's a super sunny day. So we're making the most of it. Me and Finn have had such a nice hack. Uh, we're just on our way home now. And what I'm making sure that I do when we're on our way home, um, most of the hacks towards home are down a little hill. Um, it's not steep, it's just 
that hill. What it is really good for is doing my lateral work on the way home. So she is doing leg yielding both sides down the hill and then we're doing shoulder in on both sides uh, and just doing it down the hill. It gives it a bit more of an effect on Finn, I think. Uh, it's probably really good for her balance and everything. Like she has to balance herself. Uh, she has to learn to hold herself more in her outline. Um, ooh, scary stuff in the hedge and it just makes it kind of a little bit more difficult because she's already quite good at it, she knows what she's doing, it gives it that bit more of an edge and she has to think a little bit more and so do I actually, like it's crazy how much of a difference a little hill makes on kind of how quickly you can leg yield over to a certain play, uh, to a certain spot so what I do is I pick kind of a little plant that I want to leg yield over to and I want to be able to reach that spot at the perfect time and it's really really good for me um, it makes me think a lot and I have to try out kind of different levels of my aid if you know what I mean so sometimes if there's a flower that's coming up really quick I want to leg yield quite quickly over and sometimes I'll pick one that's far away and I have to try and leg yield her the entire time but slowly so it's really really good there's a tractor coming. So, as I was saying, oh bloody hell, there's another little fan! Oh! Okay, third time lucky. Uh, so, yeah, as I was saying, it's really, really good for Finn because she's coming back into work and I need to make her work her muscles. Um, I'm not so bothered about the stamina at this point because I can't canter her yet. Um, so just doing all of these muscle building exercises is really really good for her um, and it's going to help me speed up and also make the process of getting her fitter safer because she's going to have stronger muscles so yeah it's all round just going to really help us. Um, also I just wanted to say like I love this horse so much, she's so lush, it's just oh, She's such a joy and I get to enjoy all these lovely places with the lovely weather with her and she just makes everything so much fun and just enjoyable. I just love her, I'm feeling really soppy. <laughs> it's crazy because she doesn't even feel like she's had five months off, like she feels like she has so much power, maybe even more so than before which is crazy because she's had a really long time off and I just didn't expect her to feel this good. I've kind of penciled in my first show that I want to do uh, but whether that will transpire or not I don't know because it might be that she feels really good now but then when it gets nearer the time she might not feel fit enough, she might not feel ready for jumping so yeah I'm just gonna have to see what she feels like, listen to her, listen to her body um, and yeah we'll go from there. But I really really want to get out jumping, not gonna lie. I miss it so much. <laughs> Can I zoom? Mr Squirrel, how nice of you to say hello. Finn's like oh my god. This girl was such a good pony. Welcome. We just had such a good schooling session. Basically, I put out three sets of poles. So I have one over there, one in the middle, and then one in that far corner. I was able to do lots of leg yielding, shoulder in. Um, I was doing halt transitions and then making sure that all our transitions were really, really forward. Uh, and at the same time, we get this amazing view whilst we're schooling. Like, it doesn't get much better than this. It's so gorgeous. Let's have a look over the fence here. Yeah. She's like, I worked hard, mummy. Classic me, I just forgot that I brewed this tea. That is gonna be a strong tea. <laughs> you get so Come on. Finn! 
Nene. She's like, oh. <laughs> what the hell was that thing? You're such a bitch. Well, good morning, guys. It is Wednesday morning and I've just gotten down the yard now. Um, I am not riding this morning, so it's just a quick bring Finn in, um, pick out her feet, take off her rug, put her stable rug on, um, yeah, and then give her a breakfast. <laughs> Just going out to get thinners now. She's already waiting at the gate. <laughs> She's such an early bird, like she hates coming in kind of later. Um, so she's pretty much always at the gate waiting. Hi Finners! Are you ready to come in? <laughs> so sassy. Hey? Eh? So sassy. Oh hello. Good girl, come on then. <laughs> 